G'day reefers, I'm Cam the Fish Guy. Welcome to Gallery Aquatica TV. Today we're at Magic Mountains. There's been a little bit of a collapse. A few corals have fallen over, so we've been called in to glue them back into place. Now the problem that we're facing is the location of these corals is such that we actually have to get into the tank to glue them in. So I'm gonna go get my mask and snorkel, put on my board shorts, and I'm gonna jump into Magic Mountains. So here I go. I, uh, I always prepare for jobs like this by uh, ensuring that I don't have uh, any chemicals on me, I don't wash my hair, I don't put on any deodorant. Uh, Harry the cameraman hasn't been in the car with me yet but he's been complaining not stop about the smell. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna jump in. This is the hard part. I've taken off one of the lights so that I've got a bit more space but it is tight. Okay. Alright. It's getting tighter every time. Oh. It's chilly. So, I'm just going to stop here for a sec. I'm going to let the bottom half acclimate before I acclimate the top half. This tank runs at 24 degrees Celsius, and you think that sounds warm, but it's, it's not. I'm also going to whew, try and take advantage of being in the tank and kill a few pest anemones and things like that. But today, the focus is primarily on getting these corals glued in place. I've just forgotten. I've forgotten the coral glue. <laughs> Thank you. All right, here I go. So I've worked out where I need to put the glue. Uh, this point and this point here. And hopefully that will provide enough uh, grip that this coral doesn't uh, ever uh, grow to the point that it overbalances again. Uh, but it's gonna be difficult. And the hardest part is gonna be getting it, uh, the, the piece of coral uh, from here with the glue on it back down into place before the glue forms a skin. Uh, it's a really difficult piece of manoeuvre and I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it, but uh, I'll start with our, our CG glue. Uh, I, I like to use a lot of it and I need to ensure that it doesn't actually fall, the glue fall off the coral. Uh, oh boy, I probably should have started with a brand new bottle of glue, but this is towards the end. So another thing that makes this harder. This is 
not going very well. I like the glue to really sit up in a big dollop and I can hardly get enough out. All right, well, it's not nearly as much as I was hoping for, but I'm gonna try and go in with this. Wish me luck. So that's hopefully a job well done, but I'll just get dressed and then we'll go and have a look at the corals and see how they're placed and see how secure they are when the water goes, uh, the water flow gets turned back on. It looks like we've done a pretty good job. I haven't turned the flow back on, but it looks like the piece is secure. Now, what I've done is I've used, I've glued the, the Dallas colony in and then I've used one of the pieces of candy cane and glued around the candy cane and put it in a strategic location so it also helps to glue that Dallas piece in. Uh, we're well off the glass, so we'll be able to use our main clear, no worries. And I think I've also done a pretty good job at gluing that wall coral in. Um, I put a fair bit of glue in, I put it back in the same place. Um, but now we'll just put uh, the flow back on, turn the return pump on and stuff and the guys and um, be pretty happy that uh, we've successfully glued in our corals. So that's it for today's episode, Gallery Quadica TV. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Cameron the Fish Guy. Happy reefing. That's our video for today. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button and make sure you've subscribed to our channel so you don't miss an episode of Gallery Aquatica TV. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Cam the Fish Guy. Happy reefing!